I accidentally unplugged my microphone halfway through this episode. Oops. Hey, welcome back to Luke and Lewis. We are on Zoom, but in a couple of days we won't be. How good's that? The whole team is in Tasmania. I would like to officially start the Tassie era of the show today. Really? I feel like this has got to be the warm-up. I think this is like the pre-cum. Well, it doesn't have to be to do with the cum. It's just the preamble of the yeah. Tassie era. It's kind of like, it feels like the foreplay, if you will. I'm sorry to keep making this sexual. Mm. But it, it no, does... please go, go ahead. I've, we've been locked in our rooms by ourselves, so oh, go great. for it. This is like the tasteful fingering before a beautiful <laughs> night in bed. If you, yeah. This you is the, the, clear, uh, uh, the clear, concise, affirmative consent before the Tassie yes. period. You know, show. like just halfway through Spy Kids 3D mm-hmm. and... Hand on the knee, it begins. Yeah. <laughs> Someone probably just related a little bit too hard to that. <laughs> yeah, very hard. Imagine I've been doing a bit bit of my tour where I ask couples if um like if <laughs> like well, where they went on their first date and a lot of them say yeah. movies and I'm trying to figure out like just along my journeys as a comedian and and as a human being and as mm. a scientist, um what is the least tasteful to most tasteful film to uh to do a fingering in? And my right. discoveries on the tour have been quite alarming. Some people move in at bizarre times. Like, I don't do it during a kid's film. Right? Yeah, I, I would say that uh, there's almost... Hey, well, okay, there's two different types of movie fingering. There's an at-home fingering, which is totally fine. I, I would say at-home fingering is fine almost no matter what you're watching. There's don't, movie cinema, is, I would say it's almost the complete opposite. There's some moments, like, don't do it when, like, Mufasa dies you know what I mean like there's yeah it's disrespectful that, that's just like being a bad person but I don't know you also yeah, don't want to be watching like a 9-11 documentary either like that's, that's true. not on yeah you can't be like halfway through Zero Dark Thirty like the uh, <laughs> the recreation of it I know it's not a doco but like yeah. you can't it just anything on the subject feels wrong it's also yeah. weird to do it during like when it, you know like those war movies based off a true story like if you're 45 yeah. minutes into Black Hawk Down the yeah. helicopter crashes and you're like here we fucking go like you're, yeah. that's crazy if you if you kick it off during the opening scene of Saving Private Ryan you need to be put into a home for everyone else's safety yeah <laughs> And that, yeah, and if you, not only if you are the one who initiated, you're a psycho, but if you then accept it, you are Mm. desperate. Like, and this goes Mm. for girls too. Do not, if you are leaning in, you know, if you're trying to initiate some kind of hand job during these moments as well, it goes both ways. If you're fingering, if you're pegging your man during Forrest Gump, there's an issue. Okay, yeah, so uh, we we agree. Not every film then is appropriate. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. But, um, but... What's happened think, to your brain? No, I'm just what trying to think of a, no. I'm I'm trying to think of a film that's appropriate. I can't even think of one. Maybe like uh, Fifty First Dates with Adam Sandler and Jennifer Aniston. No, nah, I I would say like a like a sexy film, right? Like what's that film about? All Happy the Gilmore. Yeah, well, or um, sexy film. You could go with Magic Mike. You know. Although you might feel a little bit inadequate watching that. Like, if that gets her in the mood, you might be a little bit off-put by it. Yeah, I mean, I would feel insecure watching Channing twerk it. I don't know what he does. I've never seen it. The point is, yeah. guys, this is the pre tazzy episode. How about this? How about this? <laughs> if, if anyone is currently fingering or being fingered during this episode, is that appropriate or not? No, I think that's fine. Sound off. That's fine. Uh, in fact, highly encouraged. Yeah. I think during a podcast is fine because you can kind of just tune out. Yeah. Yeah. There's no there's not much narrative to this. I mean, and people it, are, you know what a lot of people, maybe this is, you know, that we haven't realized this. A lot of people we discovered earlier fall asleep around the 45 minute <laughs> mark of our episode. Is that because around the 30 minute mark of the episode they're fucking <laughs> Let, sound off have you be honest have you ever done a route or yeah. any type of sexual activity yeah. with this podcast in the background and Kill be t- honest Kill I don't want to hear any no. funny bullshit I, wanna, no, no. I want the truth Lewis you missed what? it Keelan put up his hand uh, that <laughs> is hang on you guys had a radio show before I met you oh okay okay that's slightly less bad because if it was while we were working with us I thought you were doing it at work I was like dude I've missed this <laughs> 
<laughs> like while editing the episode. <laughs> All right. Well, don't say you've done it and not tell the story. Oh, so I, I thought it was pretty clear. Like I was, we were having sex and Triple M oh, oh, oh. Digital was on. <laughs> <laughs> Amplifying the now. 